Hi everyone, welcome to our WordPress series. Today we'll be showing you the installation of a theme onto your WordPress website. Let's get started. Before we begin, in our last video, we showed you a demo website that we created using WordPress. So let's take a look at it again. It's right over here. And in this series, we will be showing you how to recreate the site step by step. Let's begin by logging into your WordPress account. So it's your domain slash WP hyphen admin. And in our case, it will be sampledomain.net slash WP hyphen admin. And type in your username and your password. And once you have logged into your dashboard, you will see there are various links on the side. And these will allow you to create a page, add a blog post, and also a plugin. But today, we're going to show you how to change the theme. So let's select Appearance. Theme is a preset package containing graphical appearance details used to customize the look and the feel of your website. Or it could be viewed as a template for the WordPress website. And once you select Appearance, there will be two different tabs. Manage themes, this will show your current and past themes, but we are going to select the other tab, install themes. And here in this field, you can enter the name of the theme and search it up. Or if you have a general idea of what you want your website to look like, you can use the feature filter right over here and check off multiple boxes to narrow down your search. Or they also have different categories up above over here. There's the featured. So lots of templates for you to choose, or the newest. And last but not least, the recently updated. And I saw something in the feature that I like, so I'm going to go back to that link and preview the buttercream. It would look like this. And I'm happy with it. So I'm going to go ahead and install it. And click on install now. Once you have successfully installed the theme, you can preview it again to see what your website would look like with the content that we have at the moment. And in order for your recent change to be updated and published, you have to select the activate link. And let's go back to our site and hit refresh. And there it is. And let's go back to our dashboard. And I'm going to select install themes again. So let's say for whatever reason you're unhappy with the theme that's offered and the one that you chose, you can always upload it from an external site and use the upload link over here. In our next video, we will show you how to upload the theme and install it onto your website. And this is it for this tutorial, so thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please contact us through .easy.com with our live chat support, telephone support, and support ticket. Don't forget to like us on Facebook and subscribe to our channel.